Hello everyone. Today we're going to do, um, oh this is a vegan morning. We got um, a rabbit. He's skinting everything. He's already skinned. But it's sad. Already cleaned him. But here he is, right here. Hope you guys can see. My baby rabbit. He was not our pet. She got him from the market. He's already clean. I'm going to cut him up for you guys. You see his poor little legs. Arms. He's got little arms and legs. Little arms. So I'm going to go ahead and start clicking. I'm going to cut this up. And then I'm going to put it in the frying pan. This is going to be almost a sweet sour. You guys can probably hear them shooting fireworks in the background. So ignore that. You know, this one's got a little more fat on it than one. I pulled a lot off already. So what I'm going to do is cut the arms off. My kitchen shears. And then I'm going to go straight up the middle. I'm going to cut right across the mid section of the body. And these are baby ribs, like, that's like the bony part. Hey, Hashin Bud. Welcome back. No hashing bud. Today we have the rabbit. And Ryan, I'm cutting them up. See the ribs? Happy New Year to you too. Happy New Year. Again, you probably can hear the um the fireworks in the background. I'm cutting the rabbit up. Yes, she said rabbit. <laughs> we'll cut the leg off. We cooking Bugs Bunny today. If you are vegan and this bothers you, then today is not the day for you to be on this on this page. Well, we always cook meat anyway. So this is the leg. The thigh part. Just like a chicken thigh. He said, how does it taste? Like chicken? I think it's tougher than chicken. It doesn't fall off the bone. It's very good in gravy. So I'm not a gravy fan, so we're not doing gravy today. I feel like gravy gets salty. Once he's all cut up, I'm going to rinse him again. I think there's some little pellets in here. 
Like little fragments of pellets. So here it is. It's all clean in pieces. So baby, I'm sure it's gonna eat some. Papa Bake don't eat rabbit. If he didn't know what it was, I think he would. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh. You answer his question? Oh, I'm sorry. Where do we get a rabbit from? Never the farmer's it. market. Well, it's his market. But, I mean, it's his market on the corner. I think they're about to close. It's the leaf. We're going to use my spices today. I guess we're going to try some. <laughs> they have um, sheep, the whole sheep. I think it's sheep. No, they have goat. The whole goat. Um, the hog or uh, pig, whatever you want to call it. Um, and some other things there. Cow tongue. All of those good things. So I'm just going to sprinkle it with my seasoning. It's a little sweet coffee. Did you have a taste of Probably not. Last night. He said, I've had a whole pig before, BRB. Okay, we'll still be here. Look at the habaneros that we're going to use. I cut one up already. It's frozen. Wait, hold it up here. Right, right. It takes away the color. The light is so bright. Let me yeah. see if I have another one. It's frosted. It's been in the freezer. It's still, it still looks light, but it's orange here. Yeah, it's brighter than that. Like a bright orange. I cut one up already. We're going to have some well-seasoned rabbits. I never had rabbits, too. I think I want to try it one day. What's in it? You know, I have to look up it. Look it up. That rabbit juice in the cold. Getting the rabbit juice up. How's, how's everyone doing today? Comment down below if you're watching from YouTube. And for the people who watch our YouTube videos, these are streamed live on Twitch through Mama Bape. It's M A M A B A P 3. That's our name on Twitch.
I don't want it to be flowery, I just want it to be tasty, like, like with a little water on it, just for it to be sticky. Hey, how is Lawsy? Hey, lady. How you doing today? She said you have your sub button. Yay, congrats on affiliate. Yes, we made it. Thank you. Thank you so much. And I appreciate everyone's support. She said, hey, what are we cooking today? And I'm good. How are you guys? We are doing well. We have rabbit today. Yep, it was a whole rabbit. Yes, Skip. I just <laughs> cut it up. Skip and good it. It was pretty sad. But... Yep. <laughs> this is a thigh. She said rabbit. Looks like a chicken thigh. Not really yet. Yep, we have rabbit. Honestly, it does taste like chicken, but it's like a tougher version of chicken. You know how chicken can fall off the bone if you cook it long enough? I feel like the rabbit gets tough. No. To me, it does. It's more lean. It's lean. Lot of it. <laughs> that rabbit. <laughs> I had got tired of it because we were eating it so much. And Papa ate frying fish. He's outside in the back. Oh, it makes me sad. I love rabbit. I know it was sad. But it's gonna be good. Bugs Bunny tastes real good. Sorry. <laughs> you can see his little backbone and the, the little chunky legs and the arms. She said it's okay. <laughs> She's laughing. Yep, that's what we're doing today. Simple. I forget who it was that wanted to watch um, the cook pot greens. That's why I don't hunt. I can't bring myself to do it. I cry when I hit a rabbit or a squirrel on accident. No, we're going to bring it in in the house. We're not going anywhere. We're going to do our countdown down with some white wine and grapes. Yeah, I can do that. No, we got the other grapes. I'm going with the other stuff. No, <laughs> I'm saying just the countdown. You do whatever you want. You Y'all yeah, can drink mine. You can drink and then you eat the grapes before it hits 12. The last 10 seconds. I don't like wine. It's my style. I don't like one. I tried it. Mm. I don't like it. Well, you put your stuff with your grapes. So good. Okay. 
I had red one on there. I didn't like it. Yep, that's Are you going to be asleep when the New Year's come in? This is the part with the bone, the grip. The dodo was good. It's sweeter for sure. Red wine is really bitter. But well, that's why I didn't like it. <laughs> okay. She said red wine is bitter. Yeah, I'm gonna stop it. Um, Merlot is bitter. She said risotto. I think that was a typo. She said she'll be streaming tonight until at least midnight at my time. I think the rain messed it up. Rain messed it up. For some people. Yeah. Oh, they, they, um, they're not doing that anymore. They probably got stuff for people's houses. Yeah. I don't think the rain messed it up. It's cold enough. Yeah. No, they're still doing stuff at people's houses. They don't care. They've been doing it all this time. Yeah, she said that was a typo. <laughs> but yeah, try white wine. White wine if you don't like red. I'll sip it. <laughs> Are you watching from the computer or from your phone? This is the kind that we have. In. Well, Scott on Scott. She said, yeah, give it a try. I don't like white wines either. But depending on. Is this one the sweet one? She said, it depends on which one is good. I don't um, drink white wine either. But I like Moscato. Mm Only way I like wine is if she's cooking with it. So you can't even tell. This looks like chicken. Yeah, it does look like chicken. See, she said the neighbors down the street are having a huge party. The whole neighborhood lined up with cars. No. Nope. It's not even 4 p.m. there. It's popping firecrackers and stuff here. She said you should get something more. I said for what? <laughs> ain't going over there. Yeah, I gave the dogs meds just in case those fireworks ain't died. What you give them? I seen videos where they would just put headphones on them, like the ones that go over their ears, and they'll be sitting there watching the videos on their own laptop <laughs> during the 4th of July. What's the name of the medicine you give them? Give them a few. She got these dogs high. Oh, it's oil. See the oil. That's funny. Yeah. Well, if it works. See how it looks like chicken? He was never really scared of fireworks. Mm -hmm. He didn't go crazy though. He laid down to be scared. Yeah, but some animals they just freak out and run around the house and stuff. He didn't do that. Hey, Lady Bait. Hey, Lady Bait. My vet said it works better. Is it Puma? 
my smaller cup is on antibiotics, so give him potatoes might mess up his antibiotics. So he told me to be ill. They have them in the store. They have the hips too. Ladybug, we have having rabbit. I was going to text you, Lady Bates, but I still do that work. I didn't know. Oh, okay. Did she know what was on? I guess so. Did you get a notification? Oh, she sent the eyes for the rabbit. She said it looks good. Oh, she got up at 2.30. I was almost late for work. Mama had to come on, wake me up. I would have been like 15 minutes late. You smoke that whole thing? 30 minutes late, really. She said she had a notification. That looks so good. That's why I was trying to do this early. So we could, um, just in case I had to go. I didn't want to start and sit here. But I would have finished it if you had to. I'm gonna finish this in the um the oven, y'all. This is one of the arms. She said she was 15 minutes late today, but didn't care. She was starving. I had to get food. That's all I do. Especially on Saturdays. I go right across the street from work and go to Zaxby's. Or go to Subway. Like if nobody's there and it's okay. I was 20 minutes late before. Trying to get a sandwich because these old lady was in the line. Didn't know what she wanted. She had too many things to get. Yeah, we get that on mustard. Coffee is your only breakfast. We don't drink coffee. I don't like it. I don't like it either. But I like frappuccinos. So it tastes like ice cream. I like the vanilla frappuccino with extra caramel. You run off coffee, it's a problem. Yeah, it is. You what? She run off coffee. Yeah. Always logging. They know me at Full Jangle, so. They always ask me what time I work so I, so it's ready. <laughs> well, that's good. At least you got somebody looking out for you. They still don't know me yet. You know, folks, they ain't old things what they used to be. Mm -mm. That chicken ain't got no seasoning. Mm -mm. I think they're looking for looking at the um, sodium level. They need to season that chicken. Feel like fried chicken.
That helps a lot when you go somewhere and they know you and they have your stuff ready. She said the Cajun chicken biscuit is good. No, it's not. I used to get the uh, just the chicken strips and I get it with honey mustard. I put a little bit of water in this pot, like I always do. Can you say something? Oh, it's hot. Yeah. It's freezing. Beer. Mm -hmm. So she's making the, the sugar glaze. So she's using pineapple juice this time. Did you shake it first? Yeah. <laughs> um, so this concentrated spice is a bit of bottom. That was pineapple juice. Sugar. Huh? She got a phone. Huh? I made the drink with the rest of the sign up with you. I forgot you got me allergies. Yeah. I'm about to get a black. Yeah. This is going to be real hot. So she put habaneros in there. In the sugar stuff, chopped up habaneros. Everybody here knows my number by heart. And it's the phone. Hey, Jazz. <laughs> Do you want your regular? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to go back to Susie's Wings. I haven't been there in a minute. Well, last night I spent um, the time to clean all my glasses and my chandelier bolt. I got to clean this one up here. So that's not going to take long. I'm not going to put it in the dishwasher. I'm just going to do it by hand. Yeah. So what you going to bake that in? What? So we have 900 watch minutes on YouTube right now. 964. But this looks really good. And 206 views. That's in the last 28 days. I 
many things? Eight. Back in the day, my uncle used to make these, um, it was like, he used to fry these, this bread on top of the stove. I forget what, is it whole cake? Mm-hmm. Richard? Yeah. Uh, what you doing? Uh, I'm going to put that next to Yeah, because I was thinking that grease still hot. Yeah. All right. I'm going to put some rice. Huh? Rice. Put this in the pan. Let's grab it. You can come say hi. Papa Bake said hi. You want to try this? <laughs> you dropped it. It's right there on top. You went too far. That's just skin. I don't mm -hmm. want that. <laughs> I want the meat. I'm sorry, I can't help you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, cooking bugs bunny. Yeah. It's New Year's Eve. It don't count. Huh? <laughs> it's New Year's Eve. Yeah. Well, bunny deserves the, the, the bring in the New Year, don't you think? Well, he was already dead. He's going to bring it in. Yeah. Bring it in my belly. Well, I'm a turn. I thought I had the oven. So, guess what I'm getting ready to make? If you guys were paying attention. I didn't clean up yet. Make a mess. And That's why I was like, we need to do this early. <laughs>
Oh, Miss Court Court. Yes. What is it you want to change for next year? I want some money. <laughs> so you want to make more money? I want some money. So what are your goals to, to make that money? Get that money. Get that what? Get that money. Get that money. How are you planning on getting it? Go get it. Don't worry about all that. <laughs> that money. That. It's a chicken and you squeeze it and the egg come out the bottom. It's on rum wheat. It's a toy? Yeah, it's a keychain. And there was this video on TikTok where this dude had a chicken on his lap and it just released the egg in his hand. He had to catch it. He was shook. So somebody is suing King's Hawaiian because they thought the bread was made in Hawaii. They yeah. said it's misleading. <laughs> oh, they said New York man. Yeah. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, you can clean it. New Yorker Robert Galinsky. Could be an old black man trying to get some money. <laughs> Never know. Yeah, it comes out. You see what one of these? No. That's the grill on that. Mm -hmm. And the other one's right here. Oh, you gotta move stuff. This thing will be sitting right in the eye sight. Oh, damn. Yeah. Mm mm. Uh uh. No. Put it back where you got it. See, that's why I can't read it. Not going to can't read it. Oh, no. Look at it. That works. But you can't use that in all the time. You can use them in these. Yeah, look at that. You can use them in these. Like one. My bank account looking real unstimulated. <laughs> you ain't get your money yet? No. You get it. Cause you said everybody got. I was reading the meme. Huh? I was reading the meme. Everybody should have it by the end of the year. Before the beginning of the year. So I don't know. Beginning of the year tomorrow. You back, babe. In a couple of hours. You get it in the year. Got an email saying that you know, I get mine either. I'm getting a paper check. You know why? Because I'm getting it. No, they said it ain't coming because you need too much. You know how? Yeah. I'm going to call it. I'm going to get it. Hi. I'm going to get some back. Email. You know, I didn't get that email. Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll just whoop it on out of there. Whoop it up. Mm -mm. You ain't getting it. That's the goal for 2021. Get your money. Legally, I say that. <laughs> Get your coins legally. Well, that looks good. 
Russia do que a dor. Pois é. Celery with cream cheese and bagel seasoning. They don't look like seeds. They're like seeds. Yes, legally. <laughs> Do it the right way. She said she got kicked out. I don't know what happened, but I got kicked out. So oh, that means you need to get fiber. Did you tap something on the accident? Get your coins legally. All 2021. <laughs> Y'all is live. Huh? They can see you. Yeah, well, you want to be You gotta filter yourself <laughs> doing all that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she laughing at you. Doing all that on camera. <clears throat> it could be other men just watching. <laughs> all right, I'm done. See? Oh. <laughs> Look, he don't like it. <laughs> now you know. <laughs> this going on YouTube too. <laughs> Is that frozen? Mm -hmm. I can tell. You don't want to break. Always run the knife under hot water, then cut it. Well, it cuts fine with the knife. That's a good knife. This is a. I'm trying to. This is a. Um, He's fish. Mercer. Mercer style um, knife. I got this when I was in school. Is it good fish? It's high carbon, no stain, German steel. Good night. That fish was good. It is good. Probably hear me smacking. I'm sorry. <laughs> what kind of fish is this? Sway. Bob size. Sway. Let's reach out. It's a type of um catfish. She said she bought her mom um, new pots and pans and a knife set for Christmas. <clears throat> what set of knife you got her? I was gonna get my own date something else. I'm thinking about getting it, but she looked at something that she saw and it's like kind of the same thing. So if she don't get it by a certain time, then I'll get it. It'll be after Christmas, obviously. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't tell you. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She said it's a Cutco knife set. Mm -hmm. Cutco? Mm -hmm. I think that's how you say it. C-U-T-C-O.
please. <laughs> she said they had that nice set for years, so they bought her another set. All you have to do is keep them sharp. Front part. You got some ASMR. Front of the microphone. <laughs> this is for the um YouTubers. <laughs> Hopefully y'all can hear it. Yes, I have to put my mouth open. So have y'all seen that um it's this lady on my six hundred pound life, but she eight hundred pounds and she sat a whole cake on her stomach and ate the whole thing for a YouTube video. While she was in the bed. Yeah. Like she had a um set up and everything for her phone. I think she was in the bed. Look. I think she was on a couch. Oh my god, what? Yep. Eight hundred pounds. It's viral right now on um Things Twitter and Instagram. She ate a whole cake. I said at this point, I said I don't support those type of YouTubers because at this point it's an addiction. You need help. You don't need those views. I said that's toxic. Yeah. And then if they get bashed and all that stuff, that's gonna make them want to eat more. But the comments was like. This is why we fat shame. I'm like, what? Hmm? I guess if you supposedly fat shame them, it makes them lose weight. I don't know. I don't fat shame. I'm just saying, like, you need help if you that big. I mean, I get people do have issues keep keeping weight off and disease. That's too far for sure. Yeah, it is. 800 pounds, you need help mentally. I don't support that. Mm -hmm. leave it alone. Yeah. Don't go out the way to bully them. Yeah, that's what I do. I just let it. I don't watch their videos. How long did we use up this now? I did say she used the um her stomach as a table, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I gotta send y'all the other one. Not for me. Oh. <clears throat> gotta just leave them alone. Let them do what they do. Don't even comment. See me being short, I'm four eleven and a half. If I hit one thirty, I'm gonna cry. The most I've ever been was one twenty seven. Cause I had gained seven pounds in a week from eating McDonald's three times a day. That's why I throw shade at McDonald's all the time. Cause they made me fat. She didn't get that from here. Yeah, it no. was on my. I was at my dad's house. They always trying to feed me every two hours, so I got fat. And now I refuse to eat McDonald's. That's right. 
going to be good. So after you know what would have been good? Um, fish cake. Salmon patty? Salmon patty. Fish cake. Salmon patty. Oh, fish cake. What did they like? It's salmon patty. She said after her second surgery, she gained 35 pounds. And it's been hard to get. That's some the steroids. Didn't they have your steroids? She said she's 5 foot and 145 pounds. I absolutely hate it. It depends on where it is, though. Like, if it's in the wrong places, then I would understand. But if you think you got junk in the trunk, you're good. And you might have muscle, too. <laughs> See, I can be 130 pounds of muscle, but I don't work out, so I know it's not muscle if I hit 130. They had her on steroids. Mine is all in the hips and the thighs and stomach. See, it's in the right places. You got choice in your thighs. It looks like someone slapped a semi truck around my waist. <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> so, what you saying? You have love handles? Is it love handles or stomach? That's the heaviest you've ever been. She had a muffin top. So That's you got love handles. handles. See, I got both, but it's not huge. And it's all about what you eat, too. Carbs will do that. It's also on the stomach. I look like I'm bloated. It could be the food you eat. Do you drink soda? Soda, a bunch of junk food, sugar and all that. Carbs, yeah. That'll do it. I cut out sugar for two weeks last summer and I lost some weight. I don't know how much, but I lost weight. I could tell in my clothes. No soda. The sodium intake is pretty high. Mm. Yeah, I cut soda out completely a long time ago, like two years ago. I stopped eating burgers unless it's homemade, so that's not even, what, twice a year? <laughs> used to be a gymnast. So I had to start working out again. It will help with your back pain too. I got that too. I got scoliosis. <clears throat> so I cracked my back a lot. It hurts anyway, but it, it relieves it. It could be that um, fanny pack too. Because if you get certain, a certain weight, you lean it back trying to hold it up. She broke her back in eight places. She was about 12. Arthritis is real. You have it? I'm glad I'm not out there. Okay. I made, made it my business to be in the house. I mean, there's no reason to be out there. It's raining. It's, just, it's not raining. But still, it's wet outside. Make this. She has slight scoliosis. And it's mostly the breaks didn't heal. They didn't heal correctly. I have bad, bad posture because of it.
to opt out of surgery at the time. Because back then, the only option was metal rods. Mm -hmm. I was offered the surgery, but I didn't want to do it. Metal rods and that back brace. A lot of kids had that growing up. I'm scared of surgery, period. That's why I got my teeth pulled. What teeth? My wisdom teeth. Oh, that's what you see for that. Still. Now there's a lot of other options. Yes, I had a thick plastic back brace for two years. You can scrape it like this. Mm -hmm. I never had a brace. They told me I would grow out of it. I think I did. I wonder if he added something to this. Okay. All I put in there was the tiny pepper. Almost there. She got children every six months and had to get a new one because she was growing a lot. Just butter rice. Oh yeah. So we found two more bags of broccoli in the freezer. But no cheesy broccoli rice tonight. Mm -mm. We all backed up. Can I have one too? <laughs> Thank you. This is the go to when you haven't used the bathroom. Put this whole pack in your drink. <laughs> and you'll go within a couple hours. I know I'm going to. Because that's the only thing in there. <laughs> That's what we made in our last video. Right. The cheesy broccoli rice. Oh, yeah. So it's up on YouTube. That was some good eating. She said this are five or one cookies. That tastes mm. dusty. I don't like No, that. I like those, but they, um. They are too good. They taste powdery. They give me gas real bad. That's everything moving down. I have to get me some water. <clears throat> so, when I left the market today, I went to the store to get some water. How about they didn't have none outside by the they didn't have none outside by the gas pump. I'm gonna just rip it. That's all extra. <laughs> Cause I want to use my pieces. You gotta use your pieces. This is a good smoothie. I made a smoothie last night. I still ain't getting no smoothie. That's a sign you need to buy it. Save your money. You got stuff here. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you can sprinkle this on your food. Just like bitter fiber. Hey, mirror like the better. Enterprise is just a cool fucker. I feel. Mm. She said they are dusty. 
they are. Looks like they put too much fiber in it. So you can taste it. Boom. Chaka boom, chaka boom, chaka boom, boom. Good, good. Let me show y'all something. Not my cup. Hold on. Look at that. Ooh, it's getting hot. Uh -huh. She almost dropped the rabbit. <laughs> no, it was just hot. The hands were getting hot. Yeah, boy. Now I can show you. Got the sprinkle of the peppers on there. Yes, it is crispy. I ain't got no no pan to it. No what? Doing my dinner. Okay, let me fix you a plate. She said I made cookies once and put Miralax in the mix, and my brother ate six of them before. He had realized what he ate. Or you realized what he ate. Oh. <laughs> well. He was feeling right good after the third, the second day. I don't know if I can drink that mirror like that water. It tastes, it's got a taste to it, but it's mm. not bad. It's not too bad. Mm -hmm. I did it the other day. Make the tummy feel funny. No, it's not a taste. It's not, that, mm -hmm. it's doing the same thing. Mental. What part yeah. of the chicken you want? Mental. Um, rabbit. Yeah, it's what part you <laughs> want? Goodbye. <clears throat> I'm not hungry anymore. The thumbnail. So this is what we gonna call this? Red habanero. Fire rabbit. We need it today. There you go. Butter rice. You want some butter on top of your rice? Yeah, what's enough in here? Butter rice. And ginger. Mm hmm. She said it was a nice day for him. He spent all day in the bathroom. Enough food in your life? Mm hmm. Broke that like he was tall. Mm hmm. It Mm-hmm. Take the spice. Not yet. Huh? You want a daredevil? It's got a smoky flavor. <laughs> you ain't blowing. <laughs> She's not blowing it. I didn't eat all day. I'm 
I'm watching. <laughs> All I had was Takis. The blue bag. Mm, that's good. Mm -hmm. It tastes like chicken. I think we should make more juice with it next time. Mm -hmm. Need to eat more often. I'm tiny. Oh, mm. I got this spice. That's the good part. I think this would have been better in gravy. No. Gravy is better. No. I don't like smothered steak. You know they be putting it in gravy and stuff. I don't like smothered steak either. I don't like nothing smothered. But this would have been good in gravy. Unless it's smothered in hot sauce. It's only smothering I like. <laughs> you want to taste? <laughs> laughing at me, smothering smother. hot sauce. <laughs> Y'all Lady Bake must got kicked out again. She like gravy on certain things. It would have been good on this. Pop of bait. Time to eat. Honestly, I think you need a little more salt. A little more salt? Mm hmm. On what? This. Put you some hot sauce on it. It's got salt on it. But it's really hot. <laughs> See, I got a scoop of my finger up. <laughs> That's why you use wooden spoons to get hot stuff out of here. No, I had laid it on the stove. Yeah. Well, Pete. Hope y'all bring the New Year's in right. Get your money legally. <laughs> Be safe. Be blessed. Get your money legally. <laughs> <laughs> Stick to it. It was nice starting up for the new for 2020. One. For 2021. We're going to do much better. We're going to have more things. Because I have to learn more stuff. And it's going to be a whole lot better. Yes, I'm praying that everything is a lot better than it is this year. It's time for 2020 to go. So people, we'll be back tomorrow. I'm cooking collard greens with smoked turkey, smoked turkey neck, black eyed peas with smoked turkey neck, and we're gonna do like the turkey wings in the oven. We're gonna bake them with some vinegar and some um some good seasoning and butter. So, thanks for watching. Make sure you give us a like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, share with a friend, family member, binge watch, follow us on Instagram, link is in the description box below. Thanks for watching. Take some other hands. There you go. <laughs> you all on this side. The camera up there. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Have a happy new year.